Hey, it's Annie, and today I had planned on sharing a tutorial that's kind of like a, a simpler makeup look. It's what I'm wearing today, really simple, like a sort of a no makeup makeup look. I've had it recorded twice already today. The first time the lighting was off and the second time, I don't know what happened to the video. I, I think I was trying to do too much today because um, I had somebody coming over to pick up some furniture that I was donating. I'll talk about more about that in another video. So anyway, so I have that for you. I will film that again and I will have that hopefully on Wednesday, okay? <laughs> Welcome to my world. Menopause, yeah, okay. So um, instead, I'm just going to talk about what I used, okay? I'm going to talk about what I used, and then I will share the tutorial on. So I'll talk about what I'm wearing today. Um, so I was looking for a makeup that I can take with me for traveling this summer. I wanted something that was a, um, had a blush, highlighter, contour, eyeshadow. I did some searching, and I found this palette here. This is by Charlotte Tilbury. This is called the, what is it called again? The Instant Look in a Palette. Okay, I think I was holding that upside down by the way. It's this way. Um, so it comes in this beautiful, beautiful palette. I don't know why I sound like that. Beautiful. Like it's a crazy accent. I don't know. Um, I'm going to tell you the price right away, so don't like panic. It was $75. I know it's kind of steep, but I will tell you, I've said it before in videos, but if you didn't see it, I'm definitely on the high end of makeup, okay? Always have been. I mean, when I was in high school, I went from wearing like CoverGirl to Clinique to Lancome, okay? So I've always been on the high end of makeup. I just, I just find it works better for my skin. I don't know, I just, I am, okay? I haven't found a lot of drugstore makeup that I like, but maybe you can help me with that. Maybe you can make some suggestions in the comments. So, so anyway, so I was looking for one and I found this. And so there it is. These are all the colors that I'm wearing today. I think they are so, so pretty. Um, so excited to try it. So I tried it today for the first time. So what I wanted, in the summertime, I, like to wear my makeup a little lighter. I probably will do a little bit more. I mean, I think this look would look better on me if I had my false eyelashes. Mm -hmm. um, otherwise, I really like the look. It's really light, really soft. I think it's a nice look if you don't want to wear a lot of makeup. In the summertime, my skin tends to get a little oilier, especially if it's humid then my makeup will melt off my face. I don't care what I put on. If it's really hot and humid, like if I'm in Florida, my makeup will melt off my face, okay? It just will not be on all day. And I still like to wear makeup. So um, this is a nice look because I just feel like it's really light. I don't have to go crazy on it. This is a nice look. And again, I'm gonna show you this look. I just don't have it for you today. Sorry about that. Um, so I wanna talk about this. So. What you get in this palette is you get three eye colors, you get a um, contour, you get a highlighter, and you get two blushes, all right? They are, they blend beautifully. I love the look, I love the colors. I think these colors will work with a lot of skin tones. What I love about it, it's, it's everything you need to have with you. So you could just stick this in your purse and keep it with you if you had to touch it up. For me, I'm gonna like having it on vacation because I don't have to bring three palettes. I have everything I need in one thing, in one little case. Because girl, I will tell you, last year I went on vacation and I just went on a two day trip and I had so much, like my bag was so heavy and most of it was my skincare and my makeup. Truth. Um, so I'm trying to pare that down so it's not so crazy for me this time. We're gonna be staying a little bit longer, but I'm just trying to compact everything. So that's what attracted me to it, but I love the colors. Um, they actually have another palette too. Charlotte has another palette. It has, the eye colors have a little bit more shimmer to it. I almost bought that one, but I don't know. There was something that attracted me to this, but I will tell you that I'm gonna be saving my money because I paid for this. This isn't sponsored. I'm gonna be saving my money up and going for that palette as well because their colors are so, so pretty. You're not gonna get a really dark look. You can see what I'm wearing, that's this look. Now you can make it maybe a little darker, but you're not gonna get a really intense look with this, you're not. So I'm not gonna sit here and tell you, 
oh, the colors are highly pigmented. I don't think they're really highly pigmented, but, um, but you see the color. I hope that makes sense. Um, I think that this is a beautiful contour color. I love the highlight. They're just perfect. They don't look, they don't look overdone on your face. They're so pretty. The blush is so soft, so natural looking. I love the colors. Makes me want to buy more of her makeup, okay? Like if you want to check out her makeup, this is probably a great introduction is to, to purchase this. So, so, so that's what I use on my face. I love the colors. I, I really do love this palette. Along with that, before I even tried this, I bought like three of her colors and there's like three more colors I want to get of hers. Again, I'm a I'm definitely more of a high-end makeup person. I just find that when I find, if I'm looking at the drugstore at makeup, if I look at a lipstick in a container, I don't know what it's going to look on me, like on me. So I like to be able to go to a department store and find makeup, try it on, see if I like it, okay? But I will be honest with you, I didn't do that with this. This, I actually looked at her lipstick finder, and so I selected colors according to you know, they have like a redhead with, with fair skin. That's me. And then they have a blonde with fair skin. And then, you know, they have all different skin to tones and hair colors and what the lipsticks look. And that is so awesome that she has that. Because I'll tell you, I think the colors are spot on. If I just looked at these colors, like if I look at that color, it didn't really impress me. But seeing it on a model, when I got it, I felt like it looked the same way on me as it did online, you know what I mean? So let me go over those really quickly. Let me get my glasses. Unfortunately, I'm going to wear these glasses. Um, this is the Stoned Rose. I haven't tried this on yet. But this looks like a really pretty red, but I'm not, not in your face red. Okay, that's Stoned Rose. They're buttery, soft, and creamy. There's a matte formula, and there's another one that's not matte. Um, I have one matte, and that is the very Victoria, I believe is matte. I'm pretty sure it's a matte one. Um, but they're both very, yes, this is the matte one. I can see that the, the one has more, you can't see it on, through the, you know, the camera. But this is matte, but it's still creamy. It's not like a drying matte. Oh, love it. That's very Victoria. Let me show you that again. I'm like moving around like cola girl so this is very victoria really pretty um what would i consider that like uh they're both have more warmer tones in it although that's a little more pinky compared to the stone rose and then this is the um penelope pink and that's what i'm wearing and i'm i'll show you this has more of a corally color a corally tone but when you look at it, it doesn't look like much, right? When I saw it, I'm like, that doesn't look like much. But on, it's really pretty. And then I got the Pillow Talk lip liner, and I'm wearing that today as well. Let me do a little swatchy brew here, if you can see it. It's kind of like a, I'd say it's like a corally pink, more on the coral side. Really pretty. I mean, I've used this to line my lips, and then I'll fill my lips in, and then I'll put like, um, like this uh, lip gloss from Marc Jacobs, Sugar Sugar. I'll put that on top. So pretty, so pretty. I love it. Love the lipsticks. Makes me want to buy like three other colors. Um, never. This is the first time I tried her makeup, and I'm really, really loving it. Um, when I ordered, and I haven't tried them yet, but I will let you know what I what I think of these, how they last, if I'm gonna like them or not. I got two um, samples of foundations, so I'm going to try them. I'll let you know what I think. If I like it, don't like it, I'll let you know. Um, but that is it, guys. That's all I wanted to share with you today. I was hoping I'd have a tutorial on this look, but I will do that on Wednesday. I will do a step-by-step -step, um, tutorial on this, but I really like it. I think it's really, really pretty. It's just really soft. If you see what I look like before makeup, because this probably looks like, wow, it doesn't look like you're wearing any makeup, but it's really nice because if you look at what I look like before and then with it, it's like, wow. And it looks so subtle. It's like a really pretty subtle look, I think. So that is it, guys. Thank you so, so much for joining me today. Please make sure you give this video a big, big thumbs up. 
and thank you so much for subscribing just make sure you click that little bell too so anytime i get a video you're uh, notified of it and if you're not subscribed make sure you subscribe just click that button below and it, as always you can follow me on my blog white lace cottage on facebook twitter instagram snapchat i'll leave all the links below i'll leave the links below for this as well again this is not sponsored i paid for this with my money i will add affiliate links to that and um, I always disclose that affiliate links. If you purchase something on there, I, I receive a small commission for that. You don't have to, if you don't want to pay for, you know, if you don't want to, you know, shop that way, that's fine. It's no big deal, but I just put it down there. It does help support my channel so I can continue bringing um, more videos to you. So that is it guys. Thank you again so much. And I will see you next time. Mm. Bye guys.